Hey guys, make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications if you're new so you never miss a single video. Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another GTA 5 online video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the green color bulletproof helmet and we will be using the director mode glitch to do it, the solo director mode glitch. So the very first thing that we're going to do is hit that like button and let's get into this intro. This is Dom ZNT, aka glitch guru welcome to the channel guys yes we are going to get the color bulletproof helmet this only works to get the green bulletproof helmet though sadly but um the very first thing that we're going to do is we're going to go down to the clothing store we're going to go to the helmet section or the hat section we're going to go to helmets and we're going to look for the brown digital riot helmet or the blue digital riot helmet now i did see a video of somebody doing it with the brown digital riot helmet and in turn that gave them the green bulletproof helmet so i decided to try it with the blue digital riot helmet to see if we could get a different color bulletproof helmet but sadly that did not work so i'm guessing it won't work with any of the other colors either so with this glitch we could only get the green color bulletproof helmet so i know it's a little bit depressing but we could only get the green color bulletproof helmet using this glitch so i'm going to put this helmet on and then we're going to go up to the time trial and we're going to start our time trial up now the time trial does change from week to week every thursday when the updates come out during tunables so you guys want to look for the time trial just by hitting options open up your map press up on the d-pad a couple of times and it should land you on that marker set a waypoint and then make your way up to the time trial all right once we make it up to the time trial we're going to grab a vehicle then we're just going to pull up to the time trial hit right d-pad and then we'll start the time trial up once it's started we'll hold down on the d-pad and then we'll switch to any story mode character that we want i do recommend that you guys be careful when switching to franklin because it could go awry a little bit so all we're going to do is once we get into story mode is open up the interaction menu and launch director mode once in director mode we're going to go into our shortlist and we're going to remove any and everything that's in here by hitting triangle or y if you're on xbox to remove it your shortlist should be grayed out now if it's already grayed out cool you're good to go you don't have anything in there next we're going to go into actors animals and we're going to shortlist our chicken hawk bird then we'll back out go into our online characters and we'll shortlist our online character as well by hitting triangle from here we'll back out back out and select exit to story mode once in story mode, we'll launch director mode right back up. And if you guys don't have a bird character unlocked, check out my video. I do have a video on it. I'll try to post the card right here at the top right corner. Boom. All right. So now that we're back in director mode, what we're going to do is go back into our shortlist. So from here, we're just going to switch between our bird character and our GTA online character. And we want to do this for approximately 26 minutes until we see our character glitch out and jump on top of the haystack. They will teleport on top of the haystack over here where the birds are duplicating that. And that takes approximately 26 minutes so you guys can set a timer i usually go afk i put my controller face down with the l stick pointed up and we go watch a youtube video and we come back in 26 minutes so we'll skip ahead and i'll show you guys what that looks like let's go so 26 minutes later my character is about to get glitched out jump on top of the haystack and that's when we are going to be able to access our modded outfit so right here our character teleports on top of the haystack all right, now we want to over duplicate our burst just to make sure that we are going to stay glitched out and our character isn't going to turn back into a normal character and we lose our modded outfits. So I'm going to do this for about three to four more times going back and forth duplicating, you know, over duplicating the burst. After we feel like we've over duplicated the birds enough, we're going to land back over there on the bird. We're going to hit triangle to remove it. It's going to take us back over here. We'll hit circle to back out, go into actors, beach bums, and then we'll just go down to bodybuilder, any one of these categories, start pressing square and see if we have our modded outfits. All right. So press the square to change the appearance, X to change your appearance if you're on Xbox. So from here, we do have our modded outfits. We are glitched out. You want to make sure that your characters aren't turning back into a normal character and once you are sure of that the very next step is to look for a outfit that has a christmas mask that's going to stick all right so we need an outfit that has a christmas mask that we know is going to stick so that means a christmas mask like the penguin one or the elf mask without glasses now in order for this to work you guys must follow the instructions of this video exactly how i laid them out we do need to have a christmas mask that sticks so the elf mask or the penguin mask 
I think the reindeer mask works as well, but I'm not sure of it. I never use it, but you want to use either the penguin mask or the elf mask, the one that doesn't have glasses on, all right? Because we are going to have to leave direct mode and come back to direct mode. And the elf mask, like this one right here, is the only one that does it. The penguin mask, the reindeer mask might do it as well. There is a cookie mask that works as well. I tried it here, but the one that I used didn't work. But anyway, we need to shortlist at least three of these outfits, all right? So I found one right here. So I'm going to hit triangle to shortlist it. And you guys could also go into LSFD at this point once you find one of them and then press square to change your appearance. It should change the color of your outfit. You should retain the Christmas mask and you can shortlist that as well. And you can do that up to two times, all right? So you guys can do that. But for me, I'm gonna just see if I can find another working mask that sticks. So I'm just doing some experimenting right here as I usually do, but um, it didn't work out in the end, but whatever, you know, we do have our two Christmas masks in here. So this was the last one that I found and I shortlisted it, boom. All right, so once we have these inside of our shortlist, what you guys wanna do is go into your shortlist and then we're just gonna take one of these outfits inside of director mode. So as you guys can see, when we go inside of our shortlist, we go down, you see that the color of the riot helmet has changed to all black, great. From here, we're gonna select one of these outfits and we're gonna take it into director mode. All right, once inside of director mode with this outfit, we're gonna hold down on our D-pad and we're gonna switch to any story mode character that we have available. That's gonna land us inside of story mode with this outfit on. Now, in this case, sometimes when you use Franklin, you might start getting attacked by a gang or whatever like that, which acts as if it's a mission. So I wasn't able to launch director mode back up immediately, but that's what we're gonna do next. But um, it's actually okay if this happens to you because it happened to me and I died, but the glitch was still working. So you could actually die at this point to get rid of that mission. And once you respawn, you won't be on mission any longer. But this is why I recommend that you guys don't use Franklin, you know, use Michael or Trevor when you switch to your story mode character after hitting the time trial. But anyway, we're going to open up the interaction menu and we're going to go down to direct mode and launch it when we can. So we're in story mode with that outfit. Then we launch direct mode to come right back over here. All right, so now that we're back over here in the trailer, once we go into our shortlist, we go down, we scroll through the outfits. As you guys can see, the riot helmet turned into the green bulletproof helmet. Let's go, let's get it. Hit that like button, we in here. Now this only works with the green bulletproof helmet. I don't know why. You know, we can't get the red one, we can't get the white one, you can't get the blue, the pink. I don't think you can get any other color using this method, all right? But anyway, once we have it, we're gonna select this outfit. We have our Christmas mask on and we have the bulletproof helmet on. So we're going to select it, go into director mode. Once in director mode, we're going to hold down on the D-pad, switch to any story mode character that we have available. We should now be in story mode with this modded outfit plus the bulletproof helmet. From here, we're going to hit options, go to online, start up an invite only session. Now, this is if you're on PS4, we're going to use the more from GTA event. But if you're on PS4 or Xbox and you don't have that, you don't have the event, and I know for Xbox, you get, you can't use the event, so you guys can check out my video. It's up on my channel right now. I posted it about a week ago. So what you guys would do from this stage right here, once you're in story mode with the outfit, you guys wanna have a friend start up Crooked Cop, invite you to Crooked Cop, make sure that the clothing is set to player owned. You guys will launch that mission up. Go check out the video for the rest, but from there, it's pretty simple. You get kicked out of the mission or you back out of the mission once you kinda start it up slightly, blah, 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 blah. Anyway, check out that video for that. So. What we're going to do now, if you're doing it the way that I'm doing it, as we launch this invite only session up, right when the screen turns greenish, that's when we want to hit the PS button, go down to overview, go over to the right where it says now playing, go down to trophies, down again to where it says more from GTA 5, and we're going to select this, and once we select it, it's going to continue to launch us into a session, but we're not going to actually go online. We're going to get an alert message, it's going to say fail to connect and it's gonna kick us back to story mode after accepting this message. So once you guys see this fail to connect message, you guys wanna accept it, it's gonna kick you back to story mode. And once we get into story mode, that's when we're gonna make sure that we are fully loaded in and we can move our camera and then we're gonna close the application and then we'll launch it back up and we'll go from there. So I'll see you guys back in a second. Okay, so I'm back. We're launching the application up now. 
and we're going to go directly online with this outfit so once you guys get to the load up screen make sure that you hit square or whatever button it is for you guys on xbox to go directly into an online session from this load up screen what we're trying to do is avoid that error when joining a session message so we're trying to avoid that and we're trying to just make sure that we do get the outfit as well to make sure that nothing interrupts that so we're going directly into a public session now you guys might see yourselves for a second when you finally load in and then it might give you that message of an uh, error joining a session and kick you back to story mode if that does happen all you guys want to do is accept that error message as long as you can see yourself with that modded outfit on before you get that black alert screen then you know that you will get the outfit you know that you will get the colored bulletproof helmet so once you accept that alert message it's going to kick you back to story mode then you guys just want to launch up another invite only session come back online and boom you guys should have the green bp helmet online working as of right now patch 1.50 down znt showed you how to do it make sure you guys hit that like button subscribe to the channel as well but uh all we need to do now is go and save this outfit and we're good to go guys if it has a duffel bag on it then you guys got real lucky you got a duffel bag with it as well but you guys know that you got to go down to the mash shop to save it but since i don't have that we'll just go to the clothing store and save it as normal and we're good to go we can transfer this helmet using a telescope glitch sadly we cannot use this glitch to get the white bulletproof helmet or any other color bulletproof helmet but if you guys don't mind experimenting with it like i was trying to do then go ahead try it out leave a comment below let me know if something happens if it does great that'd be amazing you know we'll be doing that and do a video on that as well but that's it for this video you guys as always i'm trying to get this channel up to 100 000 subscribers i need each and every single one of you guys watching to do me a favor hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you're new turn on post notifications so you never miss a single video please help me help you you guys and keep bringing you these great gta 5 online videos until next time this is your boy glitch guru officially Ew. peace stay loyal and click one of those videos on the screen bro what you waiting for you already know we got the white duffel bag we got the freeze christmas mask we got the freeze joggers the freeze trying shoes we got it all man also don't forget to check out the merch store link is in the description below we also have the three face face mask out right now full nose and mouth cover 25 dollars is not really that much if you want to support the channel definitely grab one also stay safe stay protected stay assured peace out guys